Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, Sal Mahajan. And in today's video, we're going to be taking a look into Amazon Comprehend. So let's dive right into today's video. So firstly, we're going to discuss about what is Amazon Comprehend. It, Amazon Comprehend is basically an AI ML managed service provided by AWS, which helps you to understand insights related to your texts in documents. So you can think of a way it's a managed AI service or ML service that helps you analyze your data. Now this data could be structured or unstructured data. It's basically a na natural language processing model. It helps you to simplify document processing and a couple of use cases where you can use Am Amazon Comprehend is if you want to analyze your call center logs. So a call center generally has tons and tons and tons of unstructured logs. And of course, you cannot sit and go through each one of those logs. So you can put those logs into Amazon Comprehend and Amazon Comprehend can basically provide you insights related to your logs. You can use it to process financial documents and also you can use it to process legal documents. So this was a quick overview related to what is Amazon Comprehend. And now let's dive into a demo so you guys can get a better understanding what exactly is Amazon Comprehend. Okay guys, as you can see, I am on the AWS management console and I have opened up the Amazon Comprehend page. You can see it says it's a natural language processing and text analytics machine learning service provided by AWS. So let's quickly go in and start analyzing a text so we can click on launch Amazon Comprehend. And you can see this real time analysis opens up for us. And you can see it gives you a quick overview wherein you can use real time analysis with built in tools, or you can create a custom real time analysis with a specific endpoint. Now you have your input data where you have your analysis type, where you, do you want to go with the built in analysis that is, you know, um, that's created by AWS, managed by AWS and maintained by AWS, or do you want to go with a custom analysis type? For this use case, I want to show you guys how um, Comprehend works. So we're going to go with the built-in one. And this is some input text that, you know, um, AWS has provided us over here. As you can see, there's a max character limit of 5,000, but we only have 578 characters over here. Um, you can say you, you are like, you know, um, you're specifying the person's name. He works at some company, his credit card numbers, his payout out some auto pay settings and you know many more details so this is a sample text that we provide to comprehend now you can see this is uh, uh, not completely structured I would say this is a bit of semi structured but you know we want to analyze this um, you know um, in uh, this input text so what does comprehend do for us as you can see these are the different insights that you know um, comprehend um, has analyzed through that input text so we have a couple of entities it's saying you know the person's name is an entity um, the company's name is an entity uh, the credit card numbers is an entity and much much more and you can of course scroll down and you can see it says that the results are over here it's saying the person's name what type of it it's a type person and the confidence level that it is now you can see the company's name is over here um, it says that it's a type of organization and what's the confidence level that it is now you can see um, over here we have given a credit card number but again aws is unable to figure out exactly what it is hence why it puts it into the other category um, even though there are some indicators mentioning that you know this is a credit card number so uh, you can see a couple of key phrases you can see what are the different key phrases um, you can look into your language of course now we have written everything in english hence why it says that a language so comprehend also allows you to detect language of the text that you are inputting and another really good thing is that um, comprehend allows you to analyze or allows you to figure out what pii data do you have in your documents um, so you can see it's saying that the name is a PII field with a high confidence of almost 99%. And then again, credit card number. Now you can see over here, it is able to detect that this is a credit card number, hence why it's giving it as a PII. Um, again, 
date and time uh, we would not consider this as you know much as PII but again if there was a birth date over here mentioned that would be a crucial PII and then again you know your bank account number bank routing all of that is also PII data uh, another cool thing is that you can find the sentiment of the text that is provided um, over here so you can see it's able to provide you that um, it has about 14% confidence that this is a neutral text, about 13% confidence that it is positive, um, zero negative, and it has some 70% uh, of mixed confidence is there. So again, that's a really good thing, you know, especially when you are trying to analyze your call center logs, looking into sentiments will be very, very important. Of course, you also have target uh, targeted sentiments. You can view all of the results over here. And finally, you have uh, synt uh, syntax, um, wherein you can see that, you know, okay, hello, it's a, a proper noun with uh, what the confidence. So the confidence is pretty low. It's only a 36% confidence over here. So as you can see, you will be able to figure out the syntax also of the text that is mentioned so quickly let's go and let's let, let's take a look into um you know sentiment um we're just gonna say um hello i am very um happy um you know we want i just want to show you guys how the sentiment is going to change so we're gonna we're gonna click on analyze and you can see that there is a 98 percent confidence that whatever text we have inputted has a positive sentiment now, of course, you will not find any entities, um, no, no key phrases. Of course, language is still going to be English. And of course, there's not going to be any PII data. So this was a quick run through on how powerful Amazon Comprehend is and what all can you extract from your um, unstructured data, semi-structured data and much, much more. So I hope you guys did like this video. If you did, please make sure to leave a like, do subscribe and do comment if there are any other topics out there that you guys would like me to cover. I hope you guys have a great day ahead. See ya. Take care. Bye bye.